All right, ladies and gentlemen, all you wonderful people out there, the arena is back with our special mission. We are trying to make MK1 fun again for the community and I hope you guys are ready for an incredible night of spicy sets and hopefully some great commentary by that ancient duo here on the mic. Robo, once again, we return and I hope you guys have a wonderful Sunday so far. Robo, what about you? Everything all right so far, my friend? Great to be back, you know, whenever I host with Robo. It feels like coming home. Robo, I'm excited. I'm excited too, Rip. Always love being here on the mic with you. What's up, chat? What's up, YouTube? What's up, Twitch? What's up? Everybody, I was thrilled to be here. I was about to say, Robo. Yes, the entire family is back. Always puts a big smile on my face when I see that overlay here. I see the chat going crazy. And today, we actually have a reason to go crazy, Robo. Because I saw the lineup card already. And we have some very, very interesting and exciting matchups. And I'm pretty, pretty sure that the community is going to be quite hyped about it. It is the last day of week number one. Once again, Robo, I realize time freaking flies. You know, it feels like it's yesterday where we had the season finale. Now, week one, all already close to finish for the arena league series and we are of course going to find out who is going to be our next champion but i don't want to let you guys wait any longer let's take a look at card uh, let's take a look at the card together and then you guys tell me if you like what we see because robo in terms of matchups in terms of overall skill level i think these players are going to take us for a ride tonight oh yeah i saw a few sweats on there Definitely. Yes, very, very versatile. We start with Ooh. Chrome versus Muas. Muas is a player who, in my opinion, is flying a little bit under the radar. One of the best Middle East Johnny Cage. And if I remember correctly, Muas even won the Colosseum, the regional based Colosseum for the Middle East side of things. But regardless, Robo, insane player. So is Chrome. I expect a Potentially game five already in set number one, <laughs> but that's just the beginning. Rinsler is back versus Omega K. And I already have my candle lit Ooh. up in the back robot because <laughs> the matchup I want to see, and I hope that Rinsler makes this happen. Lee May versus that crazy, crazy good Shao. That's what I live for. I think this might even be my favorite set of the night if it's gonna happen, Robo. But there's more. The Nezhem, another Middle East <laughs> Alpha Sweat. Super, super good Gears. Unique game plan as well. But today, on the other side, I see Red Bull. And I think Red Bull at this point, he doesn't even need an introduction anymore. One of our they YouTube favorites. People love seeing Red Bull in action because it is just 110% rushdown all day long, Robo. No zoning, <laughs> nothing. Just straight up in your face pressing buttons. That's what Red Bull is known for. Oh, yeah. But, yeah, Robo, match number four. name on here. Do you see that, Robo? Our oh, yeah. boy, of course, Makuran, here in the arena as well. Right now with a phenomenal season start. We have an updated leaderboard tomorrow, most likely, after week one. So you guys can actually see, okay, what does the ranking look like? Most of the time, especially in the first week, you know, it doesn't make that much sense because the players are limited to three sets a week only. So a lot of people are actually battling for the top one spot right now. Okay. Doesn't make sense, but tomorrow we're going to update it for the community, for Everyone who can't wait, watching this on YouTube as well, feel free to join our Discord. We post the rankings there. You can take a look at it all the time and check out the entire leaderboard. And yeah, you're going to find Robo at the bottom of it, as expected. Hey. But hey. let me get... <laughs> wait, Robos, I'm sorry. <laughs> but let me get back to the lineup because Monkey Martian is going to play versus Makuran. And then last but not least, of course, you know it, it wouldn't be in Arena Stream without a debut fight. Kado... Ermac, that's what I saw on the sign-up message, versus Natty Dread. NA Showdown Robo, are you excited? I think this is going to be a great night. But wait a minute, Robo, that doesn't look like Scorpion to me. Yeah, all right, so we've got Johnny Kano. The chat is saying, Rip, you're tripping, this is Scorpion. No, chat, stop trolling me. <laughs> Check your, check your glasses for scripts. Yes, Muas on Johnny and Chrome with a little surprise here for the community bringing that noob cyborg Mavado combination. I like what I'm seeing, but here comes the pressure. Of course, Johnny Kano, the go-to combination when it comes down to competitive Johnny gameplay robo. Very hard to beat. And it seems like, you know, I, I'm usually here just checking out MK streams. And every time I'm on a stream, I see Mo's uh, just wrecking people with this genre. It oh, is, no. but the big surprise and... I out of nowhere. Yes, and Fabs and I, we love to talk about that. 
I don't know why, but Johnny Cage is a character we really don't see that often anymore. Like, not a lot of Johnny players are left. People switch to different characters. And uh, so, yeah, quite unique. Yeah, I still think he's an amazing character. I see people regularly say he's got no bad matchups. Uh, I don't know if that's accurate or not, but uh, I can't think of any. I think we can all agree that John definitely has a great matchup chart. Not a lot of bad matchups, if there are any. But Robo, this is such a close round. Both players on life support. Here comes Crow. Ooh, the down two. All right, the Mavado. Confirm. Yeah, Mavado is so useful in terms of these, you know, proximity OSs because Mavado comes only out on hit, so you can actually juggle quite easy with him. Great utility. I mean, Faisal always showcasing the potential of that cameo specifically because it's his favorite cameo in the game. But here, with oh, punish yeah. time! Just a conversion machine. And everyone forgets about that little fly after the knockdown. Yeah, the good old OTG, right? So many oh, people yeah. don't have it on the radar and actually die to it. Good grab. I like the strike throw. Muas. Interesting. Armor. Was able to juggle. Oh, I can't quite get it, but here. Big, big launch, and this is gonna be the round. No break from Chrome. He's saying, you know what? I'm gonna save my resources for the last round, and I agree with it. Oh, yeah. So far, this is a very back and forth set here. Ooh, goes right over that slide. Nice breaker. Our chat is talking about Johnny is still top five. I, I can somewhat see it. I, I, I can definitely see the point. Johnny is still a phenomenal character, but I think in the upper echelon of our MK1 competitive tier list, there are just a lot of contenders who are really, really, really up there. I know it's so hard to pick a top five, even a top ten in this game. Like it is very so hard. so many yes. disgusting pairings. But look at this combo. Killer Lord in the chat, going crazy. Thank you so much, my friend, for the five gifted subscriptions. We hope that everyone is having a great weekend so far. Muas, yeah, has to break here. Would have died to it. So close. Showtime. Ooh, the raw fatal. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> Muas is saying, that's what I think about your fatal, my friend. Nice try, but I'm just going to brute finish you. 101. All right, y'all. Uh, real quick, while we get into this next set here, I just want to say, because RIP is too nice to say, uh, you know what's really expensive? Hospital bills. So, <laughs> if, uh, if anyone wants to chip in today, there's that donation link for you. If you want to give RIP a hand, because uh, again, too nice to ask, but y'all know how expensive that stuff is. So, anyone wants to lend a hand, there's that link, and uh, thank y'all. Thank you so much for saying that, Ro. Thank you guys so much for considering, as as always. Ro, uh, you know what? Let, let's get back to the match. Thank you so much for being here, guys. Oh, yeah. Round one, fight. All right, let's see. Oh, what? Did you see that entire... No way. Chrome is going crazy. Do y'all think... Does, uh, does Noob have the best down two in the game? Uh, hard to say, but definitely up there in my opinion. I used to think it was Katana. Uh, Katana, Tanya. And again, do you see the utility Mavado offers here in this matchup, Robo? Like, how it many combo insane. extensions we've seen already? I mean, oh, that's with Polish! You're getting at least, like, 25%. Robo, wait. Robo, wait. Muas is still in this, and oh, here, he another safe jump in, and now it's super, super close, Ooh. but that dive kick saved him from round taking the first round in match number two. Hey, Tom back, thank you so much. Hey, you're saying reptiles down too, yeah? Oh, there's that. <laughs> Mal, how do you pronounce it? Mouths? I just, it is just Muas. Muas? Muas. All right, hey, Muas. Uh, now I don't even remember what I was gonna say. <laughs> I am mean, gonna stop jumping right in like that and sat down too. Trapped? No, Chrome trapped in the corner, and Moose is saying, "You know, let me press some buttons real quick." What the? What the? Ooh, Ooh, Ostra, that's a good call. Well, that is disrespectful. Robo is actually getting toxic in here. This man is back to him all over the place. Final round. Fight. Hey, and Peter Joe, thank you so much for the sub. 
Yeah, guys, thank you so much for the support. Welcome to the arena. Of course, this is match number one. And for everyone joining us here live from the NA side, they're like, wait, why is the arena later than usual? We had daylight savings in Europe last night. That means for the next week, we're basically off sync. For every NA viewer, the arena starts at 2 p.m. Eastern now instead of 1 p.m. Eastern until, you know, the NA side catches up, so to say. I hate time zones. Me too. But Robo pressure never ending. Uh, yeah. Now I'm going in. Here we go, the raw side though. Low connect, another conversion. How much damage can he squeeze out? Chrome looking juicy. One touch is enough, and of course, Mavado is here, <laughs> chat. This realm is oh, not a great. Noob Cyborg is such right, a fun yeah. character to watch, in my opinion. So much utility, so many combo routes on top of that. I'd say Noob and Ermac are probably my two favorite characters just to watch. I can see why, Robo. Yes, I can see why. I personally enjoy Noob Cyborg and Ermac a lot as well. Linlux, thank you so much for the gifted subscription here. Two Merchant in the chat. We have a very, very close match number one. And don't forget, guys, this entire card is filled with alpha sweats. Let me give you a little spoiler. Coming up next, for the first time ever, Omega K, one of the most unique, if not the most entertaining Shao right now, versus Rinsler. Fingers crossed that we're gonna see Shao versus Li Mei, then I'm gonna lose it. I wish I could remember who Omega K used to play. I think for a Bane player in, uh, in Injustice. The Definitely a big, hole. big name in this community, what and I'm so proud that we can showcase all these different oh, players on a daily basis, Robo. You know? Oh, yeah. But no, let, let's get back to the match, because I like what I'm seeing here. Both players playing out of their mind. Last day of week number one, and of course they're trying to get those last 20 league points to secure a better placing on our scoreboard. Yeah, and y'all don't forget that in Rips Arena, every single match counts towards your win percentage. So even if you're tied on points with another player, if they have a better win percentage than you, uh, they're a higher rank. And so every single match counts. That is a great point, Robo. But I'm I'm literally speechless to see how confident Chrome is at anti-airing Johnny Cage every single jump in down to Mavado. And that is a lot of damage as well. Like, it's not too shabby. Right, but here's Johnny with that corner pressure. I, I see Perplex in the chat with a four euro donation saying, Keep up the great work, guys. Perplex, thank you so much for that. Hard knocked down. What's for dinner? Oh, try to wake up, but this time, Chrome was ready for it. Dashing out of the corner, smart decision. You don't want to be there, not versus Noob Saibot. Oh, he, he got clipped by the end of that string, and Mavado still let him uh, convert. Oh, got clipped by the Glaive. Immediate break, but now both players out of resources, Robo. The next opening is gonna hurt if they find that hit confirm. Punish! Ooh. Man. All right, y'all, we got one even set here right now. It is anybody's game. Oh, well, this is a nail biter. Let's see if uh, Chrome can get out of this corner here. Well, that's his mission, and he found nice the right punch. timing to press. Mavado, and now Muas is the one who ends up in the corner. Chrome is saying, you know what, this is your new home now, my friend. Good duck. Party time. Spotlight on. No punish on that whiff down too. What the, what the hell is even happening? <laughs> Girl, he just, he is fishing with those down two. He was waiting for a high to come out or something. Poke special. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, well, this is so close. <laughs> Match number three. Who is going to take the lead? I have absolutely no idea. And you know what's funny, bro? Oh. Even the community doesn't know. Moors takes it, but look at our prediction. It is a 50-50. T-Bex! Oh, yes. Yes, that's what I'm here for. Chat, no. T-Bex in match number one. Is, is that even allowed, Robo? Do we have something against that in our rule set? I mean, it's only allowed if you also do an animality or a holiday-themed fatality. 
Muas is mad. T-Bax flying across the screen. Business Cat going crazy in the chat as well. Thank you guys so much for spending time with us. 350 plus in the crowd. Let's take a look at those slow-mo bags in the replay. Slow-mo bags. You need to have like a Rips Arena bag cam. We might have bag to implement cam. something like that. Let me, let me hit up our designers. We need something special. You know, the T-Bag cam. The T-Bag cam. There you go. But that means you are sitting on match point. I promised the game five to the community. Let's see if we can deliver. Just us. Thank you so much for the resub as well. For one year already. 12 months. Time really flies. Thank you. Oh, but Robo, let me be All honest right. with you. I think the only person here right now in the arena who doesn't want a game five is Muas himself, and he is teabagging again. <laughs> the mid round teabags, gotta love it. Nice down two, but I'm assuming the Mavado just didn't come out. <laughs> Muas right now looking a little bit too confident. Slide, conversion, but Chrome, he needs more than this. Not enough. Alright, what's it gonna be? Oh, nope. <laughs> Couldn't tank it. Jesse James saying, uh, Lipton Ice Tea should sponsor the tea bag cam. <laughs> Beautiful conversion there. Oh, oh, once a guaranteed meaty goes for that overhead, so it works out in the end. Sometimes it is honestly the smarter decision to not go for the optimal damage, but rather go for a pressure reset so you can keep keep that party. I am surprised. I don't think we've seen a single parry from uh, Mouth, have we? Robo, we're, we're literally getting blessed by the community right now. Just us, Total Meta, Babachi, and Grim Despia. Thank you guys so much for the resub. How is it possible that there is no hype train right now, Robo? I have no idea, but we got the hype going on. I was we say. got Pro bringing it back here. Robo, I want that game five, and I want it right now, chat. I mean, you know, when you and me host together, Riff, it's almost always a game five, first step. <laughs> it's the... Yeah, unless, of course, we are playing, you know, because then it's going to be a 3-0 in my favor every single time, Robo. But oh, let's yeah. not talk about oh, this. Yeah. Back to the match we go. Muas once again secured the optimal position here. That means Chrome back against the wall and Johnny is just pressing some buttons. Oh, flip. Oh, Smart, interrupting with Chameleon. And this is going to be... This is not going to kill, but... I mean, Robo, how, how is Chrome supposed to bring this back? Look at the life difference. Here's a good start, yeah. but even after this entire combo. Yeah, you're just one touch away from death. So let's see. I mean, we've seen crazier things in the arena, but not today. Robo, T-Bags all over the place, and we go right into the animality. Ooh. This one is on you, Robo. I'm pretty sure Moaz <laughs> listened to the stream, heard you say it. Here comes the shark attack. Honestly, I think this is the first time I've seen this animality just like in the wild, you know, like yes, not on YouTube. Same here, and that brings us to the point again that we don't have that many Johnny Cage players anymore. Oh, yeah. Hey, Mal, thank you so much. Yeah, it's got to be the best animality. Chat, what can I say? First match in the books but there is so much more on our lineup card i'm super excited for the next match i talked about it in the beginning already big curtain thank you so much for the gifted chat are you ready for our lineup card you know grab a drink real quick because now it's getting hype in here i promise <laughs> yeah i'm curious how much of our chat is familiar with omega k because uh, i know they're they're a name but they've only been here in the arena for what just a couple of weeks now, right? Yeah, that is right. Omega K is one of our arena newcomers, even though he really is an OG player. You know, he's in the oh, scene for OG. way longer than I am. <laughs> I see our community already hyped about this. Rinsla versus Omega K, a literal world premiere. This is the first time I see those two players fight each other. And at the same time, Robo, it is the first time that Omega K meets a real arena champion here in our qualifier series. All right. Yeah, Omega K. I think uh, I think Omega K was even around during like Ultimate Mortal Kombat three days. Like, the <laughs> they've been a sweat yes. for like twenty years. You know, 
30 and, years maybe. And Vobo, I want to see some message in the chat right now. Before this match starts, because the players are in the lobby, who is winning this chat? Who do you have? Is it Rinsler or is it Omega K? Well, here's the thing, Riff. I've beaten Rinsler before with my Tanya, and I don't think I could even touch Omega K. So, I gotta go Omega K on this one. Okay, let's see what the community thinks right now. 74% on Rinsler. What is the matchup? Do we see we see another noob cyborg? Interesting. Right, solo saying we win, the community wins, and that is Glorious. true. And of course, Omega K, that's what we expected. The most unique show I have ever seen. Super dope setups. Let's see. I'm pretty sure you guys are gonna like this. For everyone who's seeing Omega K for the first time, you're in for some treats. Alder saying, imagine being so old even Rip says before my time. <laughs> Alright. Here we go, go y'all. Shao Darius. This is really something you never see. <laughs> it's so filthy. Oh, we'll call him a neutral. And Rinsler is saying, do you even know that I'm a real arena champion? I'm literally taking right. notes as we speak from it, you know? Yeah, Rinsler's going hard right now. What was that? <laughs> Rinsler's working on a hood flawless. Barely lost any HP here, but Omega K, especially with that combination, he can steamroll you. A few mixes, you guess wrong two, two or three times, and then you're done. Oh, yeah. I do think this team, as filthy as it is, probably suffers in a neutral more than a lot of other shell teams. Of course. It's all about getting that knockdown pressure. Like, I feel like you want to wreck this team, just play uh, Reiko. With Robo, it is so fun to watch. Indigo in the chat with the first time message saying, Oh no, both my mains are on screen. Noob Cyber and Shao, that is actually a dope combination. Yeah, and I gotta say, Rin's gonna be doing an excellent job yes, right now. The keyboard is actually like... working. Because with <laughs> yeah. that particular combination you mentioned it, Robo, Shao really suffers when he's full screen. You know, what is he supposed to do? Yeah, he's gotta get that first knockdown. If you can keep him from getting that knockdown, then you don't have to worry about that Darius thing. Rinsler taking the lead. I see the raid from our boy Fabs. Fabs, the entire community is missing already. Cannot wait to be back with you on the mic next week. But for now, Omega K is feeling the pressure. Robo, that's what it feels like meeting a true arena champion. Woo! Yeah, and that was, I mean, I thought it'd be way more even than that, honestly. <laughs> like, wait a minute, kind of a speed wait run, a minute, Robo. Still a lot of room for adjustments, you know. Maybe oh, Omega yeah. K is just getting started. Maybe just came home from work whatsoever. Let's wait a little bit. <laughs> Match number two starting right away. So it would seem to the untrained eye. <laughs> Daddy, that is a classic Rips upplay. Gonna make me spend a ton of arena points. Rips was a car salesman for lemons back in the days, guaranteed. Guys, Omega K is a phenomenal player. I don't want to hear anything, chat. Maybe I downplayed Rinsley a little bit. Oh, no. <laughs> Oh, Mega K, now you have to win, or else Rip and I are going to get crucified by chat. Well, we're going to get sued by the community. <laughs> Chuck in the chat is saying 2K? Yes, $2,000 is the price point. Oh, yeah. How much have you given away since season one, Rip? $136,000? $136,000, y'all, yeah, all community funded. But uh, here we go. Look at this. This is close. Whoa, whoa. One touch. One touch. The poke special. Rinsler <laughs> getting <laughs> cheeky with it. Round two. Fight. Jump in. Oh, I like that down one. I thought we might see an uplock or an anti air. It's 
smart. Darius now go. slightly mistimed it, you know, couldn't get the proper meaty. Yeah. And Brinsler has the answer. This is gonna hurt. No breaker inside for Omega K. Little setup, fell for it, got flushed midstream. Yeah, it seems like Omega K is, is having a really hard time getting that Darius pressure started. So here we go. But yeah, just poked out. No Have you seen his Darius mix work a single time? Not yet. And that's the interesting thing. I mean, Rinsler has a crazy, crazy good defense, but we didn't see that many options for him. And then he got a knockdown, but no, uh, Darius. Throw combos. So that's gonna be Great. it. Uh, scaling, fatal, yeah. Robo. It is gonna scale super, super hard, but at the end of the day, not much HP left for Omega K. Let's see. Uh, yeah, he's alive. Think? Barely. It's so hard to tell. What's for breakfast? Close the chip out. Omega K. Good job! Made the right read. Shao literally flying about the, uh, above that shadow clone. I can't believe that. Alright, but here we go. We're going to get that early life lead going. So much zoning. And that's where Shao suffers so much, especially oh, with yeah. that cameo. Doesn't really have options full screen. Nice armor, here we go. Oh, yeah, you're not blocking that. Look at that. <laughs> now we're we talking. Another one? No. Darius is saying, you know what? I'm out. All these staggers, okay. micro duck. How did Rinsla <laughs> read that? <laughs> he wake up poking every single time. But hey, if it works, it works. Cash out? Go. Fatal? No. Breaker. All right. Woo! Watch out. Not just Nevado. One touch is going to be a confirm and a fatal blow. Oh, I guess Rinsler doesn't have a fatal blow right now. Yeah, but Rinsler once again feeling comfortable. You know, sitting full screen, throwing projectiles. That oh. is a punish. A little bit of overcommitment. Oh, wait, what? <laughs> Oh, but I had a little heart attack here, but Omega Me K, too. of course, that's the reason why he is playing and the bald man is just behind that microphone. <laughs> Beautiful stuff. We have a tied up match and I know that that's exactly what you guys want to see out there. 1-1. One, one. Got Fruity Fetus saying Omega K is asking all the right questions. Fruity, you're banned. I'm such a big Omega K fan. I, gotta, I, I just always love it when... People show up with non-meta combinations and make it work on the highest level. Because that is not easy, Robo, you know? With all kind of tournaments, yeah. they're always dominated by these meta picks most of the time. And then there are certain players who really just don't give a shit about the meta. Am I allowed to say it like that? <laughs> yeah, no, I fully agree. I love seeing the creativity they bring too. It's not just yes. like they watch the same thing everyone else is doing on YouTube. And, and, just and that is what we read on the YouTube side as well. You know, whenever we showcase players like that, the YouTube side is going to go crazy. And they're like, you know, that's what makes MK1 so fun to watch. These type of players. Right. We showcase creativity, something new, because we have so much potential in MK1. You know, especially with the cameo system. I know not everyone likes it. Just look what Omega K is doing! <laughs> That was that was such a crazy round. I think we saw like three or four back-to-back -back resets in the corner. Rinsler guessed wrong every single time, and that's the power of Shao Darius. But of course, you have to find that opening, and that's the hard part. Yeah, you gotta get in, gotta get past all of this zoning and spacing. But then you get that one knockdown, and it's game on. Get flushed? But was that bad because he avoided the clone that way? <laughs> Both of them trying to Ooh, find that is. opening. Yeah, great buttons, good range. Darius, X on the ground. You know, Omega K is also a master of sniping people with that low kick. Rinsler with a right, quite well, interesting, interesting combination now as well. Noob Cyborg Tremor, something we don't see that much as well. I cannot falter. Final 
Over it for days. Look at just machine gunning that low kick. I don't know if that's noobs down three or down four. But here we go. Jump in. Caught him. Oh, I'm not sure if Rinsa tried to crash something. Omega K firing on all cylinders. Here comes Big <laughs> Daddy Shell featuring Darius. And just tries to jump out. Oh, almost got a, a free combo. That my no, that nice, micro nice was nice. criminal, Rinsler. I'm sorry. All right, he's like, you want some corner pressure? I'll show you some corner pressure. Oh, this is what? such a gorgeous set, Robo. This, this already made my day. So close. Life support. Magic button is loaded for both players. Tremor getting hit. Rinsler getting the snipe. Oh, and also right. slide. <laughs> Rinsler, oh. another overcommitment oh. at the end of the round. And for whatever reason, Omega K is ready. Oh, man. General Shao wins. Omega K with the clutch, with the brood, Rinsler feeling the pressure. Yeah, I'm so surprised Rinsler went for that risky slide there. Maybe he thought it's ship out. <laughs> All right, well, either way, we got Omega K up 2 1 over Rinsler, but it is still anybody's game right now. Robo, I, I have to tell do you realize what's happening? Omega K is here. In the Arena League, his first week ever, a newcomer, so to say. And he might win versus an Arena Champion. And that is a statement, Robo. You know it as well. Oh, yeah. Rinsler, one of our strongest players. Let's see. Character switch. We go to the main. That is one of Rinsler's strongest characters in his arsenal. Yeah, Time for Reiko. Yeah, Reiko. And that is such an uncomfortable matchup for General Shao, by the way. Know, Especially with that loadout. One of the worst matchups. Yeah, look at it. Rinsler is <laughs> just going to throw those shurikens over and over again. I can see those hate comments on YouTube already. Guys, we're sorry. Blame Robo, please. If our stance is someone at my window, hear me like that. But Omega K tries right, to make it work. Shani slides. Hard knockdown. Oh, that is beautiful. Can't convert this Whoa, time. Conversion. Ooh, he's got to get past that down four. This is what I was talking about earlier with how good he is at sniping with the, uh, I think, what, what is this foul button? That little, like, stomp he does. But Omega K is so good at sniping, uh, poke with it. There we go. See, he's fishing for it. He thought that down four was coming. Can Omega K really make this happen? Can our newcomer destroy a true arena champion? So many poke specials has to somehow close the gap now, and that's easier said than done. We finished! But he does it! Robo, no. This is unbelievable. <laughs> Omega K, how is he finding those openings over and over again? Man. He is a whiff punishing machine, Michelle. Robo, I'm I'm speechless. Oh okay. that's clip. Over it. Yeah, Into Tremor. So Another wake up. And Omega K is making so many good back to back reads. <laughs> Chat, is it happening? Chat, oh. is it happening? Oh, the newcomer made the arena champion rage quit. And Omega K in the chat is saying, let me quote here Cooked. <laughs> I have no Man, words. I, I, Robo, th this has to be the thumbnail. I don't know which yeah. set of the night can top this. All right, at least now we're not going to get crucified by chat. The most entertaining, unique Shao player I've ever seen. And I can say it once again, Omega K, I'm so proud that we were able to showcase that to the big audience on the YouTube side because I'm pretty sure these guys are loving it. Shao Darius on the highest possible level and all that versus Arena Champion. Chef's kiss. Big, big shoutouts to both <laughs> players. Thank you so much for your time.
Just a beautiful set from start to finish. I love the adjustments because we could literally see how Omega K was struggling in match number one versus the spacing game from Rinsler, but then adjusted and found these pressure loops all of a sudden. And that's where Rinsler then struggled a little bit on his own, but great MK1 gameplay. But of course, we don't stop here. No breaks for the community. Coming up next, you want to see more unique characters? I got you. The Nezim versus red bull and that means we have a gears main one of the best middle east gears we saw one of the best middle east johnnies in match number one now you guys get some crazy gears gameplay but of course on the other side i see red bull red bull able to play a lot of different characters known for that smoke originally very strong ermac very strong cyrex sector so i'm quite quite hyped to see what red bull is going to bring to today's qualifier yeah, really excited to see. Um, and I was going to say, chat, you know, this is what separates the top players from the rest of us. And that's that ability to adapt, like Omega K there. It's not just hitting your combos. It's not just whip punishing. It's that ability to play your opponent and adapt to what they're doing. And what we saw Omega K do right there was just phenomenal. So, match number three is starting Red Bull versus Danejim. Another first time for me personally. I've never seen those two play each other. Janet Cage. And we have some great variety on today's card. As we have our third noob cybot in a row. Oh yeah, I just realized when I said it, Robo. I thought Red Bull is going to bring something different. But you know what? I can't get enough of noob cybot gameplay anyway. Love the character, still super, super fresh. Players are still trying to figure out how to play him the optimal way. But the Nezim, of course, gear is featuring Big Buddy Mo. Well, and Noob is a character, I don't have seen two players play him the same way. You know, he's a, he's a very versatile character. Yeah, that's right. Different cameos. This time we see Noob, Janet. Damn it, Janet, Tyler, you Right, get the pickup. Turret. Ooh, so what's that? That was the turret. All right. Red Bull fighting for his life right now, but this is definitely gonna drop. What a drop. Alright, we got Denaj. Is it Denaj? Denajum? <laughs> it is Denejum, Robo. Denejum. Yeah, Denezim but I want to be honest with you, I struggled with the name a little bit as well. <laughs> I can barely read, Rip. The community um, told me how to pronounce it the proper way. Oh, throw combos, yes sir. And that is a beautiful pickup as well with the Shadow Clone, I like that. Armoring through. Hey, happy birthday, wavy B boy. <laughs> wavy boy one. Ooh, Red Bull finding the right timing. Damn. Final round. And Robo, once again, the community Final. is blessing us. I see close to 500 people live with us. A big thank you to every single one out there who spends every single evening with us. The biggest family we ever had. Robo and I, we just wanted to say thank you real quick while we are watching this beautiful set. Right. Whoa! Whoa! Robo, what the? Whoa. Oh, dropped it. No, Robo, Whoa. you jinxed it. This one is on you. <laughs> Another chance. Time freeze. Little bit broke my brain there, but hey. All right, but Dana Gem. <laughs> Here we got Red Bull answering back. Oh, the snake. Getting a lot of drops. Ooh. All right, one more touch. Red Bull on life support, and now it is Red Bull. Look at the look at the walk down. <laughs> And that is a statement. Beautiful. Chat prediction, Robo. I just want to showcase it real quick. 79% on Red Bull. Gears. And I think the Nezim took that personally. He's like, you know, what do you even know how strong my Gears is? One of the best Gears I've seen in a while. 
Of course, I gotta add, we don't have that many gears in the arena, but I'm always happy when we see one. One. Oh, and now the question is, do we see an immediate character switch from the boy Red Bull? Out of all two of our garrisons, he's definitely in the top three. Kento in the chat is saying, we love you, Rips. Glad you're here with us and recovering. Love seeing your life. I'm so happy that, you know, I'm, I'm allowed to be here and uh, that so many people spend time with us. Thank you so much for the wonderful message. One out of the Nash and Rubble. All right, y'all. And don't forget, if you want to support Rip, there's that donation link there. You all know those hospital stays aren't free. So if anyone wants to uh, contribute, help out with those medical expenses, there is that link for you. Thank you so much for saying that, Robo. And of course, thank you guys for considering Luke. Wait, do I see Luke Kang? Red Bull, what is happening with Red Bull? How many characters can he play? Couldn't even tell what happened in that interaction. Too much stuff flying across the screen. Well, pretty long for second question there. Low HP uh, set here. We got 950 HP versus 900. But all I can say right now is that the Nezim doesn't really look that impressed by Red Bull's Liu Kang. Not at all. What's up, Holly? Our beautiful Arena Queen Holly in the chat making appearance. Welcome. Holly, the only mod I've never seen in this court. I really like the spacing. Once again, back to full oh, screen. Yeah. Jump, oh, Chameleon getting hit. Command nice, rep. So many mix ups, and that is a gorgeous whip punish. Rewind in the chat is saying, no way, bro was just in the hospital bed and now back on the grind. Hope you're doing well, bro. Rewind, thank you so much for the message. I promise I take it easy. I have great co-commentators next to me. I promise I won't overextend. But thank you so much for caring, brother. I appreciate you. Yes, great co-commentators. Me. <laughs> All right, but here we go. Uh. Now, y'all, kill or no kill? I think it's not kill. 900 HP, I think. Oh, wait. Oh, wait. I love that, that our community is immediately gifting that sub to Rewind. Of course, an absolute titan in this community. 1-1, one, one, but a close match here on screen as well, Robo. Air to air, the Nashim a little bit quicker on his controller. Time freeze. The Nashim trying to secure the live lead. Blender. What's gonna be the mix up? Oh, Robo, what the? What is, what is this combo optimization? The Nashim! He is saying Red Finish Bull who? Him. Bro, that Gears is cooking! What? What? Gears wins. Hot diggity damn. What the hell is happening here in this stream? So many surprises, back to back to back. Solo saying, that's one decent Gears, I told you guys. One of the best Gears in the Middle East. A player you unfortunately don't see anywhere else, I think, besides here in the arena. Makes me a little bit proud at the same time. But Robo Dinesham is phenomenal. Oh, yeah. I love how understated that comment is. That's one decent Gears. <laughs> so, but I see Red Bull's plan. He wants to reversal 3-0 with his main character. He is bringing the secret weapon, so to say. Smoke. Okay. Round one, fight. And with Red Bull, I think I don't even have to talk about it. We have one of the best smoke players in the entire world. Yeah, we got Holly saying, where there's smoke, there's I mean, I don't care how good you are. When you've got invisible 50-50s coming at you, like... Look at the difference. Like, yeah. it looks like it's a complete new player. Like, the confidence. The, this was close to a flawless. <laughs> Just 
no fear. Ooh, that was cancels. Back. Well, with the time freeze, trying to tie it up. Alright, is he gonna kill? This is, I know he's got that spicy damage. I think he's gonna kill him. Bam! Alright. Nice block. <laughs> if he really brings this back all the way, like from being down to zero, then I'm gonna lose it. Yeah, and of course, no matter what happens, he is locked into smoke for the remainder of this set, though that's not necessarily a bad thing for Red Bull. I do know this Red Bull, his smoke is so good, but the damage output is always so low. Yeah, because he always goes for reset. He always sacrifices yeah. damage to keep that pressure. Very good block from the Nezim here. That is going to be a punish. But generally speaking, Red Bull, even after this combo, is still a juicy life lead. Let's see how the Nezim is going to approach this. Blender. What, 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 wait, he, did he get... Uh, what the fuck? What? what? Oh, we are breaking right, the yeah, game together. <laughs> I think this is gonna be a cash out and uh, GG, see you later. I could not tell you all what just happened there. I cannot believe that I'm saying those words, chat. But Red Bull has fallen. 3-0 sweep. I can't even remember if we ever saw that before. Much less to a Garrus. That gear is, is looking more than spicy. Dinesham, what a performance. Cannot wait to see what the YouTube site is going to say about this. Because oh, Is it yeah. an upset, Robo? It might count as one. <laughs> I couldn't even tell you. What a set. I'm already exhausted here. I'm exhausted too, Robo. Imagine yes. imagine how you are. <laughs> and, you know, the problem is there is more. And looking at our next set, it ju looks just as spicy. Because it is time for Monkey Martian versus Makuran. Even though I gotta say, I'm not sure if Makuran is here and looking at my friend list, Makuran is offline. That means we have a little player change. Tetra MK is gonna jump in versus Monkey Martian. So... Mavado. Oh wait, Tetra brings something new. Right, Spicy. The Great Hall. Is there a point to this fight, Havoc? To teach you the meaning of chaos. Very close set prediction Round right now. One, fight. Alright. Looking like Ant-Man over here with that helmet. Nice funny. I gotta say, Monkey Martian, a player I have literally never heard of. <laughs> so, really looking forward to seeing what this habit can do. Tetra lost so much life already. I know, it's crazy. Fighting back. Oh, all the zoning right now. Look at it. Just those <laughs> rockets flying across the screen. Monkey Mars. Oh, Alright, so Tetra really is just falling this back here. Unfortunate Where? drop. Oh, and a big old swing and a miss. Tried it. I somewhat respect it. Round two. Fight. I'm using the scorpion to anti-air. Love it. Nice army. Little trade. Oh, that was so active. Good conversion. Side switch as well. Put him in the corner. I usually see. Uh... What is it? 
Back here, Motaro. This is gonna hurt like yes, sir. Here comes Havoc, the new Titan in MK1. Buff to Oblivion. Arguably one of the best characters in the game right now. Trying oh, to go for the neck breaker. Right. Mistimed it. But wait a minute. Robo, it's getting messy. It is really messy. It's on fire. <laughs> I didn't realize that uh, attack does damage over time. Fight. Strike throw going. Well, look at these combos, especially when you mix it with Scorpion, you know, that is so much damage. 40 plus with every single touch guaranteed. Oh yeah. Tetra serious trouble here. And, and that is Monkey Martian the taking the first match. Balls in your face. Balls in your face. Mm. All right, y'all. We got Monkey Martian up 1-0 right now over uh, that is right, Vobo. Tetra. And Vobo, we see a character team. switch. Tetra is going to his OG main combination, Sub-Zero Tremba. We talked about it before, and I can tell you, Robo, a lot of players struggle versus that particular loadout. I believe it. I love those classic ninja skins. Some risks here, but they're paying off. In here, some zero pin last 357. Nice armor, and Tetra is on point with those armor. <laughs> no conversion. <laughs> how he just managed to yeah, dodge you're seeing some crazy <laughs> stuff today i gotta say that some very very interesting matchups in my personal opinion that was a gorgeous whiff punish maximum range perfectly calculated and not just the matchups rip but like some of these teams and setups that we're seeing like what we just saw with the, the scorpion and the uh, blood balls covering so much of the screen there like i've never seen some of this stuff before mistimed it has to pay the price for it tetra securing the round let's see if we can tie it up Round two, fight. Ghetto mix. One of, you know, Havoc's new tools. <laughs> All right, Tetra fighting his way out of that corner. Nice pick up with Tremor, but drops it. I didn't realize they both have the same amount of health. That's crazy. Hey, Tento. Good to see you. Yo, Tento. Nice to see you, brother. There's the grab. Right, here Tetra. we go. So Tetra, close. Look at this out. Yes, so close. Oh. <laughs> And that's it, another tight upset right into the brute. That's the power of Sub-Zero Tremor, a combination we honestly never see be sub- Turbo Cat! Oh, I, I had a little heart attack. Turbo Cat with the 50 euro donation and a love robo. Turbo Cat is not saying for medical bills. Do you want to know what the message says? It says, What's for the hair transplant. Turbo Cat, the <laughs> I appreciate you. Turbo Cat knows those priorities. Thank you so much. Honestly, guys, thank you for everything you do for me here, and uh, thank you so much for helping me out. Yeah, just a reminder, y'all, those medical stays are not free, so if you want to help Rip out, uh, he's too nice to ask, but I'm not. <laughs> so, uh, hit that button, hit that donate button, and, uh, and help our boy out. Alright, so here we go, Getting right back into it. Round one, fight. 
Once again, I'm, I'm sitting here a little bit emotional. Guys, thank you. I hope you enjoyed the show. Rep emotional? Yeah. I don't believe it. All right, here we go. Don't just time it. Oh, nice. Right. I think uh, Monkey Parson is definitely not being cool. Uh, next snap. And here we have decent damage numbers here. Nothing crazy, but hey, 34. Good corner pressure. Never ending Tetra right now. Trying to get out of there, but that's easier said than done because Havoc has so many options. Great mix, and of course, a lot of HP. Look at this 1100. Yeah, but look, uh, Sub also has 1100. Yeah, Thanks both players, uh, you know, built like Dark Souls bosses here with those cameos. <laughs> Yeah, all I can say about Sub-Zero is that uh, Tawny got his first loss in the boss battle yesterday playing <laughs> as Sub-Zero. <laughs> that was actually um, hilarious, you know. yep. And all the Sub-Zero <laughs> mates immediately said, you know, it is the character. That's the proof. All right, down to the wire here. There's so much mix sponsored by Havoc. Armor up. That was a good oh, call out. It. I didn't even know that works. Oh. Tetra is gaming. Is this officially bottom one versus the. No, let me stop. Sub Zero is a little bit better. Twice. <laughs> wow. Fight. That's not who can you say is worse than Sub Zero in this game. Like I'm not, I'm not down playing, I'm not up playing. I'm literally just asking the crowd, like, who do you think is a worse character than Sub Zero? It actually is a good question, bro. Honestly, I imagine we're gonna get some remades. But her damage output is absurd. Ooh, get the axe ball. What happened to Tetra all of a sudden? Look at this life lead. Got Cicada, so I'm saying Cicada is worse. Robo, Tetra is going crazy. Yeah. <laughs> Monk Lizzy is on. We got that armor, got whiff punish, but he doesn't even care about it. And just lets it go. Man, what is happening? He picked a red ball or something. Tetra joining us as a jump in today, and he is sending that statement. I'm surprised we didn't get more answers in chat here. The only, only character I see listed is Takeda. In my honest opinion, Robo, some amazing sets we are witnessing here together with the community today. Uh, this has been uh, just an outstanding stream today. And after Enjoyed this, uh, if I saw it right, will we even well. see some Ermac gameplay from our oh, arena oh, newcomer oh, Kato? Hey, let's go! Round one, fight! <laughs> Get anti art. Tetra very Beautiful consistent with those. Yeah, we saw that several times already. All my sins in the chat like today has been exciting as hell. I'm so happy that you guys enjoy the show. This is gonna be our first 50 mob. Oh, so close. 491. Nice armor. Ooh, got clipped. I think it was gonna be it unless he breaks. I don't know why he's not breaking. Maybe the chat is so happy, Robo, because we didn't have a single homelander on stream. <laughs> don't jinx it. Uncle Focus in the chat with the resubscription saying party time. Thank you so much, guys.
Whoa! <laughs> that always surprised me, that amplified uh, ice clone. Alright, nice pickup! So even right now. It is very even, yeah. A super close match. We haven't seen oh. a single game five so far. Maybe this is gonna be the first one. Why does Tetra not break? Look at this. He's got the meter, he's got the cameo, he's got everything he needs, but he just ate 421 damage with no good reason. Forward to fatal. Forward to fatal. He blocked it! And Tetra is believing and in his execution, fatal can blow. save the Fatal Blow for the last round. Yeah, Robo, I was about to say the same. Is it going to be the 3-1, or do we go the full distance for the first time? Oh, nice armor, but a very weird interaction there. Good interrupt. Pop it all around this screen. Yes, I agree. With the chat is like, we're seeing a lot of weird interactions today, and I oh, agree with that. But isn't it beautiful, guys? You know, we're seeing stuff we have never seen before. I think that's what it's all about. Another Ghetto Mix here, and Martian very, very close to that game five. Good luck. Cross jump wants to get out of the corner. Oh, here we go. One more touch. I like how he uses the scorpion for bit jump. Oh, wake up now. Oh, he got clicked. No breaker available. This is not gonna kill, but it's gonna be. Okay. It's not actually kill. No, but it is sub zero we are talking about. This this can't. That's true. Oh, yeah, 470. But this is going <laughs> to do it. Tetra putting his life on the line with that full street that. slide right into the T-Bags. It's getting toxic in here. Unbelievable. Sub zero drama. Winning versus Havoc. Oh, chat. What are we doing? What a set. I gotta tell you, I thought Tetra was in serious trouble after that first round. I thought so too, but then he adapted and brought it back all the way. Incredible. Oh yeah. Oh. Robo, we have one more. I know you need a break, Robo. But bear with me, because this is going to be an exciting one. Coming up next, debut fight in the arena for the first time. We have an NA showdown. You guys know we have regional matchmaking. We have our own matchmaking algorithm. Thanks to Robo, by the way, who programmed it. That means players play within their region throughout the qualifier phase. And it's going to be Kadu versus Netty Dread. And Robo, I have no idea what we're going to see. <laughs> Yeah, very interesting uh, team here. Robo, well, well, this, this stream has been beautiful from start to finish in terms of loadouts, cameos. You know, I mentioned it already. Oh, yeah. There's our first raw ball. Just raw dogging it. We lost the pickup, have to get a reset. Understudy. It's a Melina Frost. Uh, uh, what the? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Uh, what is he what? doing? <laughs> Kato. Kato, you're a newcomer. Kato, what, what the hell? Frostball out. I, I, I don't understand where these guys are coming from, bro. Like, I don't know. I did. What's the connection? I can't tell if it's just for us viewers or for them. It's it just for us. Like we're losing some here. Okay. Reset there. Uh, armor yeah, is on going. clean with punish. I don't even know what to say. I wasn't ready for matchups like that today. I honestly didn't expect it. I do 
Jordan was saying that combo can go up to 60%. That must be the Twitter combo I keep hearing about. I refuse to call it X. Kept hearing about a 60% Ermac Janet combo on Twitter. I heard some rumors about it as well, but I've never seen it in action. Me neither. I'm not really seeing the strengths of the Melina Frost combo. Chat, Kato, this man is here with a mission. Playing <laughs> in the arena for the first time, pulling off these crazy Janet combos. This is not a new player. I thought, you know, maybe maybe it's someone who just picked up the game Robo plays for the first time. No, this is an alpha sweat. This is the person you run into in Combat League. You're like, I never heard of them, and they just absolutely stomp you. There are already rumors in our Twitch live chat saying, is this Hody's fake account? <laughs> I'm so sad we didn't get to see the full combo. Just crazy. Melina All right, but let's see here. So sticking it out. Oh, making the change to Sector. We got Melina's Sector now. the time of your passing, you could join us. I prefer to spend eternity. And the chat prediction is beautiful on top of that. It is a straight up 50 50, something we don't see that often. Round one, fight. We got Ermac buying his clothes at Spirit Halloween. Do we all have Spirit Halloween in uh, Germany, right? Uh, no. We, uh, we <laughs> celebrate it. Um, we, we don't really celebrate it, but of course, you know, a, a lot of. Uh, Venues uh, try to make money with it, basically, but but we don't really celebrate that. Uh, Ermac Janet combo. Can he can he bring this back? Throw combos, teleporting in. Of course, we've been there before. Wake up, violence from Netty. So then a one touch tech story here. And there's the one touch. Round two. Fight. Beautiful. And these two they love to press some buttons and I'm all in for it. Um Wake up buttons from both of them. Yeah. The disrespect is real tonight. Random ball roll. Oh, this might be Netty's game. Ball rolls. They're putting in some wood today. And yeah. Robo, this yeah. is it. Another tied up situation here after match number two. Last match of the night, by the way. But every single match today was an absolute blockbuster, in my opinion. 100%. This has been one of the wildest streams that uh, I've ever co-hosted. I agree with you, Robo. Yes, a little bit unexpected, you know, on a cozy Sunday, the players are delivering. Yeah, well, this would be a nice little low-key, you know. I thought so too, here, but there. I'm, I'm ever <laughs> wrong when I say that. Irma, Melina, Janet Cage, Sector. All right, so no character changes. How do I know you won't return to Quan Chi? You don't. You must. I am loving that Melina us. outfit. Looks like Jim in the hologram. Round one, fight. All right, and those raw balls are just <laughs> putting in work today. Melina players just love to do it because there is so much reward on it as well, you know? Whenever it connects, you get so much damage. Oh, yeah. Kind of flawless right now. Woo! Uh, more flawless. Nice check, though. You get changed. 
Oh, here we go. Noble. Is this the 60? Noble. What the? Oh, what the? What is this? Potato. What, what is this combo? <laughs> Yeah. Chad, I'm, I'm gonna retire after this stream. I'm, I'm done. The doc told me I'm only allowed to stay in bed and relax and, and no, Kato, you, you can't do this to me. Here's the fatal. Robo, he's working on one of the craziest combos. Yeah, this is gonna be bananas. I cannot wait to see what happens after this fatal. Right, I'm wrong. Pick up. It did no damage, but then... So, so much work, so many spent resources on Kadu's end, but it wasn't enough at the end of the day. Not almost three bars a meter. This is gonna be a nice big old punch. No breaker available from Matty. Here in America, we have a beer called Natty Ice, and it's like the cheapest piss water drink you've ever had. <laughs> We're punished. I like it. Okay, here we go. These combos are out of control, Robert. Final round. Fight. I really Woo! cannot no believe fun. how much crazy stuff we've seen today, what's possible in MP1 right now. I know, this feels almost like the game just came out. Like, we've ever seen so much stuff that I have never seen before. Ball roll. Yeah, low profiling this bad boy. Big curtain in the chat. Yes, we see you. Big curtain, thank you so much for the generosity, my friend. Like literally every single day, Big Curtain is here. Oh, I appreciate you guys. Even popping up in my streams to support me, like uh definitely a and that, and, and absolute man lad. Like an absolute man lad. A robot, Natty is a man lad as well, because this is gonna be the two-one lead. Right. And yeah, I have to say, like, I part of me misses the old days of where you had a complete character, like Mortal Kombat 9, Mortal Kombat X. Um, I guess Mortal Kombat X had uh, variations, but still, where like you had a complete character. Um, but now with variations, I do love not variation. I can't talk today, Rip. What am with I trying cameos. to say? Yeah. Uh, with cameos, with cameos, you have so much opportunity for expression and just unique gameplay it is right yeah i mean the community the is a little torn between liking and hating cameras i can understand both sides to be honest a little bit yeah i think complete characters are probably more balanced but also more boring you won't leave my sight you have my parents souls we cannot obey you empress business card with the gift it's up to our player kato here thank you so much round one fight all right so once again no Character changes here. Well, but the only thing which is possibly going to make this stream better is the game five. And once again, Janet in action dropped it this time. Sorry, oh, this one might have been on me. Just uh, throwing out green souls. Because life depends on it. You got to pay the troll toll if you want the boys toll. What? What the? <laughs> Wake up, fatal, and it works. But it works. Yeah. Here's Janet. That is a lot of that. That is a lot of damage. Wait, do, do I have the score wrong? Fight. Yeah, I was about to say, I'm so sorry, chat. <laughs> Natty is the one on match point. Now, I'm an old man. Alright, here we go. Oh, this looks just so beautiful. I think it looks janky, but... 
<laughs> but it does work. Alright, we're about to have our first game five of the day, right? But well, Wokado is working on it, and right now it looks like the curse might have been broken. And there oh, it is. Nice. Ladies and gentlemen, I cannot believe that I'm saying this because throughout our entire last qualifier yesterday, we didn't have a single game five as well. Chat, we are back. And you know what that means? I want to see at least... 720 emotes in the chat right now we're gonna take you for a ride and we're gonna set the arena on fire together for everyone who's here with us for the first time lower that volume a little bit because it's gonna get loud <laughs> and it's gonna get hot but this set deserves all the hype in the world let's see who's gonna get it is it netty or is it our, our arena newcomer kaidu i'm gonna press that magic button robo seatbelts on here we come chat thank you so much for being here all right, y'all, we are going right back in here. No character changes, no cameo changes. Oh, game five, baby. I love that feeling. With punish. You know what going crazy right now. That's some first 300 with the early drop. Okay, Janet got tagged. Well, that is not slowing down Kato. Bro, there was a quite dominant round. Kato, really here in this last match, bringing his A game. Everything on point, some good reads, good execution. Whoa! <laughs> Avoid it by doing a little hand spam there. Robo, I'm, I'm not even gonna ask any questions. Like. He was just like. Like, for real, you Molina players in chat, is that an actual, like, tech with Molina just to do a handstand over ground and projectiles? All this makes now the overhead. Ooh. All right, y'all, final round here. We're going the full distance, final, final everything. Sitpo in the chat said it already. What a match. Combo time. Already 40% to the kisser. There is more robot. Bro, oh, what the? Jesus 50. Christ, 50 plus what the? What are we watching? <laughs> all right. I think that's the first 50% we've seen all stream. Beerus might have hit 50. I can't remember. I know we hit the 49s. Wait, this is it. Wait, no, he's going to yeah. get breaker. Just oh. in time, but Netty on life support. How many random ball rolls will it take, Rip? Armoring through. Okay, Sector. The missile literally saved Netty right there. Oh my God, the and this is Itchet, our newcomer. He did it with one of the craziest puppet combos I've seen in a while. Kato, all I can say, and I think I speak for the entire community here, is welcome to the arena, my friend. What a performance. A big, big shout out to Netty as well, who took us to a game five situation. Robo, I enjoyed the hell out of this qualifier, I gotta say. We saw so many crazy matches, different cameos, different combos, different game styles. I'm a happy man, and I think we can officially call it a day here because it can't get better than this. It really can, Rip. That was one hell of a stream. That was, I'm like, I'm out of breath over here. Same here, Robo. Yes, same here. So, you guys know it. The ancient duo here needs a little break, but before we go, Robo and I, we want to say thank you for the super super big support here in the chat as always for showing up for making the arena what it is today we hope we could make your sunday a little bit better robo i had an absolute blast hosting this with you but we're going to send these guys over to another great content creator we're going to be back tomorrow with week number two of our two thousand dollar series a big shout out to the youtube side but guys have a wonderful evening stay safe we're out bye bye